What's up, Cowboys Nation? Welcome back to another video here at the TGR DC Show. I don't even feel like doing this intro. This is just ridiculous. Anyways, be sure to like the video. Uh, hit uh, subscribe for more Dallas Cowboys content. I'm still watching the game now. Uh, it's the fourth quarter, and I'm going to try my best to be optimistic. The Broncos just converted to, so I believe it's 27-0. I'm gonna try as I'm gonna try to be as optimistic as optimistic as I can with this post game reaction video, and try not to overreact because I know a lot of people are overreacting right now. Some of it is justified, a lot of it's not going to be, and it's gonna be a long week here in Dallas. There's a lot of frustration, guys. I'm a fan. I'm not just I'm just not an analysis. I'm not just a reporter. I'm not just in this because I like the game of football. I'm a diehard Cowboys fan, and when you see performances like this, it pisses you off. It pisses you off because more than anything, you don't obviously you don't want to lose, right? But you want your team to be at least somewhat competitive and somewhat competent with the game of football. This game right now, and I'm making this video right now because I think the game's over. It's the fourth quarter. Time's going to run out. Dak's probably going to throw two touchdowns. Whatever. The game's over. We lost the game. But let me say this. Guys, it's still early on in the season. We're about halfway. Maybe not as early as, as, I, as I'm trying to put it. But, guys, there's a lot of football left. And we were, we were bound to lose another game at some point. I really hoped it would have not been this way. But it, we were bound to lose a game. And uh, guys, we're right now we're sitting we're going to be sitting at 6-2. and two. Not bad. But a lot of the things that we've been talking about really caught up to us. This team, as talented as it is... It lacks discipline. A, a, it is a very undisciplined football team. And I tweeted this last week. I said this is probably the one, one of the most undisciplined football teams I've ever seen. And you see that with some of the most boneheaded plays. I mean, it's not even turnovers at this point. It's penalties. It's not being ready for the games. It's dropping passes. It's not learning the. It's not knowing the fundamentals of defense and 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 containing the edge and making tackles from the beginning of this game there was just a whole lack of effort from digs um not being physical enough at the line but i'm not i don't want to call out players i don't want to call out players i'm not going to overreact i'm not going to overreact long story short this is just a terrible game that we have to put ourselves we have to just put in the back of our minds um dak prescott went reverted back to 2017 dak prescott today um, and it was just awful to see it rightfully so Trayvon Diggs and Dak Prescott have removed them, have removed themselves. I got the dryer going in the back, whatever they have removed themselves from MVP discussion and defensive player of the year discussion. Both of them have rightfully. So I don't want to hear it for the rest of the year. That's bold, but I'm just going to say it. I mean, you play games like this. It's just just inaccuracy from Dak Prescott. Not, I, I couldn't believe it. I'm still, I'm still at a loss for words right now. Um, but we got to do everything we can just to put this game behind us. It's against an AFC opponent. It doesn't affect us in the NFC East picture as much as losing to the, I don't know, losing to the Bucks would. But we had a lot of opportunities to come back into this game, and we just did not. Play call was just atrocious we're passing the ball too much in the third quarter i get it we're down 19-0 but we did not run the ball as we should we did not establish the run as we should that's probably the biggest one of the biggest issues you can take from this game we didn't run the ball as we should have and it's not we didn't even give it a chance you look back at the first quarter we're down we're down we're down i get it i get it but let's try to run the ball we're getting some good gains on some of these runs and and kellen moore your guys is coach yeah, everyone was saying, oh, we want, we want to fire Mike McCarthy and bring in Kellen Moore. You're a bunch of idiots. That's what you are. Why would you want Kellen Moore? This man is, I can't stand his play call. I can't stand his play call. Um, 
just way too pass happy when we're obviously a run first football team with Zeke and Tony Pollard. And that should have been our formula from the beginning of the game. I'm get, I'm raising my voice here, and I I gotta calm down. I gotta calm down. I before. Oh, this game should have been won. We all know that this game should be. The, the the worst part about this is the Denver Broncos are not gonna be in the postseason. We're going to be in the postseason based on the fact that we're just the best team in the NFC East. And I've been telling you this. We've been saying this all, all, all on my YouTube channel. I've been saying this, that that the opponents that we're playing, it's not enough reps to become the contender that we should. And if we're losing to a team like this, there are better teams out there in the NFC that we have to play in the playoffs. This was not a good loss, guys. This was not a good loss. And um, I hate the fact that we rely so much on Tyron Smith for this. We have so much depth. We talked about this. We said we had so much depth on our offensive line to handle this. And now we're going to blame that the fact that Tyron Smith wasn't in the game? That that's the reason why this all fell apart? <sighs> this is so frustrating. I'm trying my hardest, guys. I'm trying my hardest. I'm just looking back. I'm still watching the game, and I still see it's 27-0. And that's still, that blows my mind, the fact that this game is 27-0. But that's it. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna stop talking about this game. I'm gonna watch the rest watch the rest of this fourth quarter, and, and we're gonna just take this loss, take it up, move on, take it, move on, take it, move on. Awful, just awful, just awful. Hate to see it, but it's a long season. We gotta see if we can jump back from this. Anyways, guys, that's it. Follow my social media, like the video, let me know what you thought about the game. Let me know. <laughs> See you guys. Go to Cowboys Nation.